Alright guys, here we go. Another pack opening video here. All Madden packs with a random Elite Final Edition player as a topper. Uh, no, no Big Pop events. I like Big Pop events though. He's a good guy. He's a good guy. <clears throat> Let's try going backwards. Try to get me a little something. Nope. He looks like he should be like a fullback. Not a D end. Not gonna lie. He looks like he has no idea what's going on. He's like, hey, why are you guys over there wearing different uniforms? There it is. Kiko Alonso. Alright, let's see. Come on. Give me something. Team of the week. Oh. Uh, hmm, really? Why not? I'll throw it in the set. Why not? That doesn't hurt, right? I don't even know what team wiki goes into. I have tr I'm I'm at the point now I want to keep doing solo not solo challenges. Just um sets. I don't see what what I can get out of sets now cuz a lot of good uh a lot of good ones you can do. Like I'm trying to do the silver and bronze cam chancellor. I think at the 99 overall. Damn it. But I'd like to have that Reveal all. Oh, I see Golden Sports do it. He got something good out of it. I didn't get shit. Okay. Maybe, maybe it'll work on this one. Come on. Alright, well, at least I got an elite. Oh, let me unselect him. What do you go to? What team of the week are you good for? Week 7. I don't... I honestly don't know who's week 7 uh, was. I don't remember. All I know is I got JJ Watt. I know that's a good hero to have. Helps my defensive front a bit. I want a lot of golds. Give me that red. Steven Jackson was a Patriot for a good uh, three weeks. Two, three weeks. M nah, maybe longer than that. I might be over exaggerating. I might be trying to act like he wasn't around. Alright, well, didn't get anything in that either. Let's, um, let's see what my topper is. See if I don't have him. And. Oh, it's Dion Lewis. What do you know? Alright, well. Oh, yeah, I already did that set. That's still pretty cool, though, for those that are trying to do final edition sets. You get a nice chance to pull one of the players you need. Now you have Demaria, so that, that card's kind of useless. Uh, well, not really. I shouldn't say useless. But um, I do a quick little lineup for you guys, too, so you guys see what my lineup's like. Start on offense first, start where the points come from. Uh, my newest player is David DeCastro. He's uh, 99 strength, which is really nice. And uh, also, the Steve Hutchinson's my newest addition to the line. So I got those two as my guards. My right tackle's uh, TJ Clemmings. I was calling him Cummings. So I would have been wrong. But for those that did not see my other Madden video, I did get this Jamal Charles from my friend Dan. And I gave him campus legend Dan McFadden. Only because I'm not a big running back guy. But I did have this Jamal Charles last year, so I did. I wanted to get him back, just for that reason, because I've had him before. And I pulled this guy, Michael Griffin, in packs. Season veteran, so he's my backup free safety now. Not too bad. 93 speed. You know, good man coverage, good zone as well. 90 hit power, which helps a lot too. I like the hit power. I still got Chong. My linebackers are the same. Besides, I pulled. A Calvin Pace, I don't remember if he was in the video, so I'm showing it in case. Flashback Calvin Pace. And uh, he's not bad. You know, 89 speed isn't too bad for a linebacker. My corners are still the same as the last time. I think same with my D-line. Yeah, my D-line has not changed. My special teams has not changed either. Only thing that changed here was my third down back, Jamal Charles now. And I still have uh, Devin Hester and... Josh Cribs as my season veteran return men. So, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed that. And I'll see you guys all later. Peace out.